hello 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 and welcome to my youtube channel it is i your favorite alchemist the alchemy goddess thank you guys so much for tuning in on this beautiful monday september 28 2020 today is the day of the moon today's energy is all about emotions setting your positive emotions for the week ahead making sure that you're not in your feelings try not to spend a lot of time crying today that would be a good idea too okay as always, if you're new to my channel, welcome. If you're returning, thank you so much for coming back. You are greatly appreciated. I hope that you guys um, enjoyed your weekend. As always, don't forget to subscribe. Ring the bell for notifications. Give me the like button. Leave a comment down below. Let me know that you stopped by. I am going to be working on the monthly tarot soon. They're probably going to be late. Um, or not late, but they won't be coming in before the, all of them won't be in before the end of the month. Unfortunately, um, just didn't work out. It just didn't work out this month that way. So, case it off a lot. I have other things that I'm trying to clear out of my house and getting my kids ready for this move. So, a lot going on, okay? But once I get settled and everything like that, you know, things will get back moving, moving very smoothly. For the past week or so, I've been doing a lot of readings and they all seem to come up about karmic relationships, soulmates, twin flames. It seems to be just in the atmosphere a lot lately. So, um, I'm not going to ask Spirit to give us any messages about those. <clears throat> I'm actually looking for messages for anyone who is feeling blocked. Anyone who is feeling like they can't move forward in life maybe out of a specific situation maybe just in general maybe they are trying to get a business going and they're having a hard time you know doing so maybe they want to get promoted but they seem to not ever get promoted you know so let's see you know what kind of blocks maybe in in your way maybe it's about a relationship okay Spirit, any messages today, September 28th, 2020, for anyone who may have any blocks in the way? Prosperity, 10 of pentacles on the table early. Money, 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 right? Stability, grounding. Mm, somebody got some good something good coming in. Earth signs, very possible. That's the Knight of Pentacles. Already the 10 of Pentacles and the Knight of Pentacles, okay? Something's definitely coming in to change things for the better, I feel. And, you know, looking at this picture, it's a rabbit. Rabbit is good luck. So he's riding or she. That's a she or he, I'm not sure. But they're riding a rabbit. <laughs> they, bring, they bring luck with them. So something is definitely changing. So if any of you feeling blocked, that looks like a definitely a, a good reading so far, right? Spirit, any messages? Hermit, Virgo energy, Virgo. I'm Leo Virgo. Virgo energy definitely in the building today. Definitely. That Earth energy with the Ten of Pentacles, Knight of Pentacles, Hermit card, Virgo vibes. Spirit, any more messages? Mm. Air energy. There we go with the King of Swords. Decisions, or it could be an air sign. Capricorn energy, too, with the devil card here in reverse at the bottom of the deck. Someone is letting go of something very toxic and unhealthy for them. A bad habit, maybe. Maybe, maybe, we'll say. It could be. Or it could just be someone is just reluctantly letting go of something. You know, they, really, they may really want to, but they're having a difficult time doing it. Air energy here with the king of swords, like I said, could be a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. But not necessarily. Just could have been someone is definitely making better choices, okay? Making better decisions about their lives. That Nine of Wands, though, reverse. Let me get a little bit more clarity about that Nine of Wands. Because I'm feeling like someone wants to give up almost. Like somebody wants to give in a little bit. I don't know why. Like someone lost a fight or someone's losing a fight. Or they feel. Let me take a deeper look at this card really quickly, y'all. Uh... It's like someone wants to get out, or someone wants. 
to defend themselves or they stop defending themselves. They stop fighting themselves. They stop keeping themselves trapped in like physical prisons. Like this isn't to me when I see this, this isn't a mental prison. It's a wands. It's the nine of wands. But look at her. She's surrounded by wands. And she's very defensive. And then here goes this circle with the star. I forget what this is called. The, um, oy vey. Oh, I can't think of what it's called. It's a nine point star. I forget what it's called. But it's like she can't. Like someone's been working something against her maybe. And she's trying to protect herself from it. But it's in reverse. Maybe they're allowing someone to, to finally do something. To help them so they can get out of it. We're going to clarify that definitely. Definitely. Spirit please clarify the ten of pentacles. Mm, it is towards reverse. Yeah, somebody's definitely getting out their head. Things seem like they're getting better. Someone could be getting some money. Yep, manifestations coming true. So, okay, so you've been feeling stuck, right? Because I wanted to see, this was about people who may have, who may, who may feel stuck in a situation. Your manifestations are about to come true. Keep letting go of what no longer serves you. You're going to find a solution. Something's coming that's going to help you solve things. Remember I said something good luck with the rabbit, right? Some good luck is coming. You're going to find a solution. No more conflict with the five of wands reversed. Reason to celebrate, okay, with the four of wands. And then we have the eight of wands reversed. So I'm kind of feeling like it's just happening slowly. Spirit, please clarify the hermit card. Somebody's not listening to the little voice inside of them. Someone is not listening to the voice inside of them. I feel like you're meditating. You're taking the time to yourself. You know, you're recharging. But there's something inside of you that's trying to get your attention. It's, some, it, it, it's something that you know about. Like, it's like, you know it's there, but you're not acknowledging it. You won't talk about it. There's something you're getting out of your meditation. Like, there's there's a message coming. Like, there's a message there. And it's in your face. And it's a, it has to do with healing. Balance. It's like the balance between greed, not greed, but like, like a midpoint. Gotta clarify that in a few. Spirit, please clarify. Nine of Wands reversed. Feel please clarify the Nine of Wands reversed. Remember I said it's almost like you're allowing someone to, to do something that you didn't let them do before. Like, almost like help you, like, work their magic. Yeah, definitely. You got the Four of Cups reversed. It's like you may not have trusted them before. Maybe they were trying to help. But now, now you definitely are. can't do it by yourself it's been it's been it's been mishap after mishap spirit please clarify the king of swords what's this king about let's see what this king of swords is about spirit please clarify the king of swords
shaking it. Sorry, y'all. Shaking the whole camera. <laughs> This king has repressed emotions and feelings, maybe even traumas, things that were done in the dark, they don't, they haven't shared. Spirit, please clarify. King of Swords. Clarify the King of Swords. They want to be with somebody. They want something. It's about happiness. Family, maybe. Hmm. Soulmate vibes. Spirit, please one more card for the King of Swords. Spirit, the King of Swords. Hmm. Somebody is no longer confused. Somebody is no longer confused. New beginnings. Well, so you were feeling blocked with this situation, whatever it may be. Okay, your manifestations are coming true. Finally, I feel like you've been in your head a lot creating scenarios that haven't necessarily been coming about, but something tells me they're about to come about. And the reason they're coming about is because you're balancing things. Like you took some time, you meditated, like I said, you're still not ready to move forward on some things, but you're getting that balance. I definitely feel that. I see good news, good change, solutions, reasons to celebrate. It's just happening really slowly. Like I said, it probably has to do with whatever it is that you were attached to that was holding you back, okay? I also feel like over here, you know, there's somebody that wants to help. I feel like you may have been very chaotic towards them, very nasty towards them, um, maybe even disruptive, damaging kind of. I kind of get that vibe here. But I feel like you're finally able to let them help, like let them work their magic. There's still some things that may need to be said, you know, and some of you really, you know, you've you made a choice before about this and you didn't make the right choice. And you're getting almost like a second opera, a second chance to make a better choice. I really do see that you have a lot of repressed feelings about this individual or this situation. OK, here's the king sitting on his throne, making logical choices and decisions. But he feels some type of way. He's not. It's not necessarily coming out. They're not expressing it. It's repressed emotions. Like they tr they kind of try to push him to the back and don't deal with him, right? And then here over over here you have the ten of cups. Now somebody wants to be with someone. They're happy with them. They finally like they they cut their options out. Like they no longer see all these options in front of them. They now see only one option. You know what I'm saying? And I get soulmate vibes with that card. I really do. We're going to finish up this reading. And again, at the bottom of the deck, new beginnings with the Ace of Pentacles. So somebody's definitely getting another opportunity at a situation that maybe they didn't have before. Or maybe they had the opportunity, but they let it, you know, pass them by. Spirit, please. Mm -hmm. Somebody is seeing things differently. Mind has definitely changed here. New projects, new beginnings, new focuses. Spirit, please clarify the Knight of Pentacles. Mm -hmm. Nine of Wands again reversed. I don't know. Like, that's the solution. You're just going to let them help. Like, you're just going to let them. Like, you're tired of getting hurt. Spirit, please. King of Pentacles reversed. Could be an earth sign, Virgo Cap Taurus, like I said before, specifically Virgo over here with the Hermit card, but not necessarily, okay? This could, you, this could just be about you not being able to maintain things. Like, maybe you need someone's help with that, or maybe someone you're dealing with can't maintain things. Like, they're not the breadwinner, you know? They're not the, the, the person in charge. They don't have it figured out. They don't have it together. They can't provide for anybody, you know? They're not that type of male masculine energy spirit please clarify the hermit card hermit card spirit please clarify the hermit card somebody definitely has been some been spending some time meditating mm, feelings changing 
Someone wants someone. It's a delay beginning with new love. I'm telling you, we have the Ace of Swords. We have the Ace of Pentacles. And we have the Ace of Cups reversed. Well, the Ace of Cups is the only one that's reversed. It's a delay. Whatever this is, is definitely a delay. Repressed feelings. Spirit, please clarify. Repressed feelings. Empress. I mean, strength card. Leo energy. Someone could definitely be having repressed feelings about a Leo. Or someone had repressed feelings about things but now they want they want to express them they got they got more to say they got more to say it's been it's, they made the wrong choice they got something else they want to say too i kind of feel like they finally feel brave enough to say it spirit please clarify the king of swords they want a second opportunity very skeptical about this though you know they're very very skeptical about this they cut their options out, but they just don't know how to move forward. They don't know where, where, where is it going to go? Where's the direction? Cancer energy with the chariot. What is the direction? Y'all got, y'all, we got every, every ace. Ace of pentacles, ace of wands, ace of swords, ace of cups. New beginnings all over the place. All over the place. They are just very hesitant. I feel like they don't know what's gonna happen like where is this gonna go are we even strong enough to handle this are you strong enough to handle this can you handle me like can i handle you can i handle this situation am i ready for this i get that vibe too spirit please confirm the ten of pentacles You're just holding on to something that's eventually going to let go. You don't want it to change. You don't want to let go. Spirit, please clarify. Mm, that's that four of wands again. This time it's in reverse. Everybody won't see it the way you see it. It'll be a self kind of celebration. Every, everything ain't got to be for show, right? Everything ain't got to be for other people to see, right? Right? So if he's clarified the hermit card. I hope I'm making sense to somebody. Like, you don't have to do it because everybody else knows you're doing it. It doesn't have to be the right thing to everyone. It just has to be the right thing to you. Spirit, so please clarify the hermit card. It's a delay. Definitely. Keep meditating. That's going to get you closer. You have a lot of hopeful energy. A lot of dream come true vibes with this situation. It's just delayed. It's something that's holding it back. I feel like I've been saying this for a while now. Something is in the way. What's in the way, right? Spirit, please clarify the nine of wands. What's in the way? You won't let them give you what you... You won't let them give it. You keep trying to give it to them. That's what's in the way. You won't let them bring it to you. Spirit, please clarify. Holding on to what no longer serves you. Are you ready? <laughs> Are you ready for, for this? You may get ridiculed. You may get ridiculed. You know, people may not agree with what this with this. Whatever this is, they probably won't. It's a lot of hope, though. There's a lot of hope surrounding it. And like I said, it'll probably be just you and one other person celebrating. It probably won't be a whole bunch of people. But isn't that more important? Or is it not? You've been creating scenarios in your head about this situation for so long. And here it is presenting itself in front of you. What are you going to do? You got to let go of what no longer serves you and move forward. You got to be ready for this, though. I'm going to be so real with you, and it seems like you're very hesitant. You may not be ready. You're very hesitant. You haven't figured out direction. Maybe you need to get more things in order. But I honestly see you moving towards whoever this individual is. They're moving towards you, or you're moving towards them. You know? And they're, they're ready to throw in a towel because, I, in all honesty, it's like, from what I'm seeing, there's a lot of unresolved issues with the two of you 
and you need to come together because you need to resolve them. If for anything to to bring a peace to that part of the both of you. All right, y'all, that's it for Monday, September 28th, 2020's Daily Tea and Tarot. Hope you guys enjoyed. If, the reason, if this reading has resonated with you, please leave a comment down below in the comment box. Don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell for notifications. Hit the like button, share, share, share. I'll be posting the monthly Zodiacs soon over the next couple days. I promise you they'll be available very, very shortly. Um... If you're looking for a personal, private, more in-depth reading, you can always email me at theblackcosmiccauldron at gmail.com. Or you could send me a message on Facebook or Instagram. I'll leave all the links down below for you guys to reach out. Y'all enjoy the rest of y'all Monday, day of the moon. Set your emotional tensions high and stay positive. I'll catch you guys manana. If nothing, as always, y'all know what it is. I ain't got nothing but love for y'all. Peace. <laughs>